Good morning, currently in the elevator going down. We're heading to Hot Pilates. I'm Alana, if you're new here, I'm starting a new vlog. My last vlog was New York Fashion Week. This one is gonna be a little day in my life, getting back into routine, a routine reset. You know, I was in the hustle bustle of New York Fashion Week, gotta reel it in before I go up north to Muskoka for a few days with work. Correct. But here's the bit. Strawberries, I need like a cow nips and stuff. But I am hella sweaty. I just got my groceries. Honestly, I just had a really traumatic experience. I was walking and there's always homeless people outside of this grocery store. And normally it's fine, but this one literally like touched the man's shoulder in front of me. And then I thought I was fine. And as I was walking in, he literally grabbed my shoulder. And I've never been like touched by anyone. And it was just not good. Okay, sorry. I was getting out of the elevator was standing there so like I didn't want to film but I was like walking in and he literally like taps me on my shoulder and like I'm in a workout set also I'm like really sweaty because I just did jaybird so like I have sweat marks all over me like I was debating coming home first and changing just for the sake of my outfit to be a little more covered up but like I was like whatever I really want these groceries I can just like walk in and walk out and he like touched me on the shoulder as I was walking in and I literally ran away and the second I got in, cause like I don't know what, where he's been, like even if it was like a normal, like someone who wasn't homeless, like I just know. So I like grabbed hand sanitizer and literally like put my shoulder, I'm gonna get into the shower um, before I do anything else. But I was honestly really scared to walk back out because I didn't know if he was still gonna be there. So when I was walking out, I saw that like a lot of, there was like literally so many of them, like a whole group sitting out there and most of them were gone, but he was still there. So like I waited to walk out with someone. Like there was this like old man walking out at the same time as me. And then like I quickly like scooted like to cross the street and walk on the other side and pray that like he didn't see me, like the guy that touched me on the shoulder. But honestly, just like a really traumatic experience. And I don't know, it's just like uncomfortable. And that is why I like order my groceries a lot. I don't like going to that Loblaws. And farm boy like just like isn't super cost effective like it's not like trader joe's in terms of being more affordable so i usually use like uber to deliver my groceries or like instacart and stuff like that which honestly is a lot more convenient because then i can go to like grocery stores that are a bit farther away from me that i prefer so yeah we are going to shower i just got some blueberries strawberries um cacao nibs i got chicken kebabs vegetables to do on the barbecue for some protein for dinner tonight and tomorrow and whatnot and i got some of that chickpea milk that i really been liking i think that's it i think that is all i got oh and i got dried mango because i had that in new york and it was a vibe so i'm gonna shower and then i'll make breakfast just showered didn't wash my hair because i think i might go to other ship tonight i'm not entirely sure yet but don't want to wash my hair because also i'm doing berries tomorrow so it's going to get gross anyhow i just threw on this shirt from aloe i'll link it below and then my lulu align six inch shorts because we're just staying comfy it's still kind of humid in my apartment um the air isn't really working, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna try. I put it back on and close the door. We'll see what happens. It's working in the hallways in my building. I don't know if they were fixing the cooling system or whatever. Decided to cancel my nail appointment because I feel like my nails are fine. Like, don't. I got them done the Sunday or Saturday before 
I left on Friday for fashion week. So like they're two weeks old. Um, I'll wait till next weekend to do them, but I think I'm gonna do the brown Hailey Bieber nails <laughs> next. We're gonna make some oats. We're making them how Kales makes them. So I'm just gonna take these oats. I just buy these ones, they're super cheap. I do really like my Ritual protein powder. I just got my second shipment of it, but I wanna try use up my new fix because it's already open my quarter cups in the wash so we're just gonna do a third but i like to do a third cup of oats serving of protein powder i'm really trying to get around 25 grams of protein per meal um i'm working with a nutritionist steph because I do want to achieve some aesthetic goals, I guess, with my body. Like, I do want to, like, lean up. I feel like I've really healed my relationship with food. But I also have put on a little bit of body fat in the past few months. You know, just, like, always eating out. And I just feel super inflamed and not my best. And I just feel like I haven't been eating proper meal since moving out so i just want to get back into good habits re-teach myself how to structure my meals you know feel really good so that's like what i'm doing right now then i've been using this milk this one has actually 10 grams of protein per cup i'm gonna do around like two thirds of this i always do double the amount of oats sometimes with the protein powder you have to adjust it a little bit um just mix this up and then I'm gonna add a little bit of salt in here okay so a little bit of salt it's honestly a game changer for your oats and then been liking to add a little bit of chia seeds to get some extra fiber and healthy flat flat fats um, I like keeping everything in these little mason jars I actually do need to really organize my pantry because they're so deep and I keep putting it off. I kind of want to find like an organizer here in Toronto to help me. So I just did um, over, oh, not overnight oats, rolled oats, the new fix vanilla protein powder, a little chia seeds, and then the chickpea milk. So very high protein. There's probably like 30 to 35 grams of protein in here, maybe 40, because um, like also the almond butter. And then I did strawberries, blueberries, cacao nibs, a little bit of almond butter, and then cinnamon and agave. Kale's does honey, but I don't have like a drizzable honey, I only have my manuka honey, but I just did agave, which is a good vegan alternative. So we have our healthy fats, the almond butter, and the chia seeds. We have our whole grains from the oats. We have our fruits and fiber from oats and fruits, and the chia seeds, um, lots of protein. So a really nice and balanced meal. I always like to strive for a balanced meal. A balanced meal is one that has healthy fats, protein, um, fiber, and then a fruit or a veggie. That is my goal when I'm trying to make a meal. That's what I'm focusing on right now. So I'm going to have this and I'm going to start editing my New York Fashion Week video. I really wanna be on top of YouTube again. So this is me holding myself accountable. I'm actually gonna do it this time. So we'll see how that goes really want to hold myself accountable to it and I'm feeling super motivated and inspired right now. I've been editing the vlog for 
the past little bit, like probably the past the past two hours, pretty much. Having kind of fun editing it, like you guys would have already seen this, but I've been doing using phone clips and making it like three like that. And a lot of fun, having fun with this. Also, I got put in here last night. It's so itchy, and I'm gonna make myself a coffee. Audrey, this is for you. This is proof that I do use my coffee machine. I just have more than one coffee a day. I have the Breville Barista Express in the black onyx, I think. But I love her. finished editing my video it took me six hours it is currently 6 30 p.m i'm gonna go walk because i've literally been in here since 12 and i was sitting at my computer from 12 30 till now um it's a really good video i'm really proud of it i'm really excited if you haven't watched it go watch it we're gonna go on a walk i tried to fix my air a million times it kind of it feels cold definitely so like hopefully it stays going I don't know, something's weird. We'll see what's up. Um, but we're gonna go on a walk. I think I might pick up dinner, like last night, picking up dinner, and then for the week, I'll make everything. I'm just so exhausted from editing for so long. But we're gonna go get dinner. Maybe I'll do Wilbur. We'll see. Um, and then I'm just gonna chill and clean tomorrow have an early start have a workout at 7 10 i don't know if i'm gonna do other ship honestly just like really exhausted and just want to hang and like relax so i'm gonna go on a little walk got the dinner they someone else took it so they had to remake it for me watching the OC and it's a million degrees in my apartment so yay be to broken AC I just got home from the Kerastas event for Genesis. It was a super cool event. We learned about the product. It's an anti-fall product line. I'll show you the products later, but I'm heading out to go to Impact to do some work with Shayna. I haven't seen her since before I left for New York, so excited to see her. And yeah, so we did a little yoga class, which was really nice. And just like, I needed it. I needed to calm down and just like, meditate basically for a little bit felt really good and now we're gonna go do some work i have to do some promotional stuff for the pod if you don't know i have a podcast morning ray today's episode came out it's monday it's new york fashion week pod with trending kales so i want to do some promo for that and then obviously i have some tiktoks to edit some computer work i'm gonna do that I'm gonna start editing this vlog i think maybe so we're gonna go to impact during my fave set from 437 in clay mask it comes out on the 20th so we'll be live when you're watching this but i'm gonna head out so i can meet Shayna. say hi. hi what have we been doing <laughs> Shayna's tummy hurts i've diagnosed her with six different things cos yes 
Maniac disorder. <laughs> I think I just need ginger candies and a doctor. I think a doctor. There's literally a walk-in right on your way home. We're trying to go to Jay We're trying to do readings for women power and politics. Because Shayna's a little academic. She's also wearing this cute set that I gave her from Aloe. It's the Aloe Soft. They didn't have this like before. I feel like they did. Maybe not that color. See my apartment and hopefully it's on a million degrees because it's been 80 degrees in there for the past three days. I really hope it's fixed. You can just come out to sleep over at my house. And I have to pack for a cottage too. And I'm going to veto shopping because I really shouldn't spend more money. right now I'm so hot it's literally 83 degrees in here I don't know if it's better with the windows open the air attempt to be on I'm I made a coffee because I just need the motivation I vacuumed all the floors now we're mopping I cleaned all the counters in the kitchen then I have to do the bathrooms bathroom I only have one It's a lot, it's a lot, but I'm gonna feel so much better when it's done. I'm doing like a before and after thing on TikTok, so. Wish me luck, I'm literally dying of heat right now. Oh, and to make matters even better, as I was making coffee, I literally spilt out half the grinds over here, like literally all of them there. I don't even know how I'm gonna clean that, but we'll figure that out later. I'm leaving that for later. Um, yeah, wish me luck. I don't know. I closed the blinds to hopefully like the sunlight, but now it's like blocking the air. I don't really know what's better. Hopefully, it's fixed by the time I get back from Muskoka because it's too hot in here. So, it's been a little bit, it's now 7.25, so like three hours, and I just had to go through my whole closet. Everything is clean. I still need to like put the miscellaneous things away, but I stopped to have dinner because it's getting late. I did the chicken skewers that I got yesterday in the oven just because I don't have, I didn't have time to go up to barbecue. I wanted to be able to put it on while I still was going through all my clothes. I have like three bags to donate. I'm decide I'm not going to do Depop or Poshmark. I just rather donate. Sheena will come through. My friends will come and like look through it, but I'm just going to donate the rest of the clothes. Really cleared out my closet. Dinner is kind of miscellaneous, but it's following um, the new like mindset I'm having with my meals. So that's protein, fats, fiber, and Proteins, fats, fiber, and wow, great, doesn't even know. Um, oh, fat, fiber, protein, greens. I don't really have greens right now because I don't have. So I did chicken, veggies, and then, so it's my, the pr chicken is my protein, the veggies is my fiber and greens, I guess. And then my protein, my fat is the pesto. Pesto, fat, chicken, protein, veggies, fiber, and greens. So we're gonna have this, maybe watch the OC, and then I'll finish doing, dealing with all of this. It's still very hot in my apartment. <laughs> apartment it feels so good and guys I have the most crazy thing on my face right now 
veteran. Shows me big? this mask. It's from <laughs> Charlotte Tilbury. Good morning. Currently walking to Jaybird. We head up to Muskoka today. Just wanted to get the workout in. Do the 30 pops. We didn't make it in time. Just wearing my Align shorts and I forgot what bra. This is oh, free to be wild. Just got help from Jaybird. I have two packages that I need to open. This one's from Ilya. I'm actually really excited about this one. I have no idea what the other one is. This one from Ilya is the Perfecting Skin Serum, which is like, or Skin Tint. The one with SPF. It's like the one that everyone always talks about. Not that I need more makeup or anything, but they wanted to send this over. So I love the brand Ilya. I love it so much. So thank you so much, Ilya, for sending this over. It's the Super Serum Skin Tint SPF. This super cute. Protect and revive your skin. I really hope I picked the right shade. I got ST5 and Bomb Bomb. So it looks like this. I'm gonna go shower. I think I'm gonna wash my hair again because it got all sweaty and I want it to be nice for the cottage. So we're gonna go do that. We'll unpack, unpack the dishwasher. Maybe I'll unpack the dishwasher before. <laughs> just got back from Muskoka. It's Thursday. I ordered in some groceries. I'm doing this reset. I'm starting it tomorrow officially um, with Steph. I can't remember if we talked about it on the vlog yet. But I got some groceries for some of the recipes that are in the reset. I got two cucumbers. I still have to do a proper shop. This is just from Good Food. It's super convenient. Also, I don't know why the packaging is like this. But two avocados, a bag of lemons for the morning drink that I'm going to have. So my apartment's a bit chaotic right now because I just came back, obviously. And I came home to like a million boxes. Spinach for smoothies and salads. Arugula, which I'm going to do for a salad right now. Um, rice cauliflower for a few bowls and then baby carrots because I still have some leftover hummus that I want to finish and I can also use in salads but I'm just going to make myself some lunch I heated up some of the chicken that I made on Monday or Sunday Sunday and I'm just gonna make salad and then I have a 437 pop-up event I'm gonna go do so I'll put on my 437 set I'm gonna meet up with Rachel and yeah Rachel I don't the vlog has never met her but she is a fitness teacher instructor trainer um she works at sweat and tonic I love going to her classes so we're gonna go together and yeah my air AC still doesn't work but it's cooler outside today so all these cool things that came in the mail um I got a surprise package from moon juice I've been wanting to try super you for so long this cosmetic cream I've also heard a lot of good things about they also sent over ting which looks really cool it's um b vitamin b and ginseng I think and then I think comb sent over stuff from their new line same with from Laneige this essence and cream and then I also bought this really cute package from cute pasta i think that's how you pronounce i love their tortilla chips nexus card came so it will work again to scan because my other one doesn't work because i put the freaking like um sticker on it from when you were in the airport and you had to get randomly tested but we're going to have lunch 
I'm starving and, you know, catch up on life. Okay, just made my salad, started mixing it, so that's why it's like half mixed. But I did arugula, this chicken that I cooked on, cooked their chicken kebabs or whatever. Um, avocado, cucumber, hemp parts, and then this balsamic vinaigrette from Mandy's in Toronto. This needs to be mixed, but just an iced latte. I put a little bit of agave in there because I don't really like the milk that I got plain and I finished it. So I just added a little agave. I'm gonna do this while doing some work. And yes, gay to healthy meals and the reset. It feels good to have like just like simple nourishing meals again. I'm putting so much trust in a body cream right now because that's what you're balancing on but i am going to take off my face makeup and I haven't worked out today i didn't work out yesterday but i do want to move um not feeling super motivated to do something insane and it's dark outside so i don't want to go walk outside so i think i'm literally just going to go do 12 3 30 on the treadmill um so walking at a 12 percent incline three miles per hour for 30 minutes. I have berries tomorrow at 6 a.m. So just gonna do a light like incline walk and call it a day. I'm not super hungry right now. I just had some chips that I got sent and salsa and I had a pretty late lunch and it was really filling. So maybe this will make me hungry. Um, I don't know like I feel like I should have dinner but then like my intuitive side is like no if you're not hungry don't eat blah blah um so that's like what I'm having trouble navigating it's like do I have a meal because I know I need to have dinner or do I not because I'm not hungry but then I'm gonna be starving in the morning so I'm gonna work out instead of trying to make myself eat something now and then I'll if I'm hungry I'll have something protein focused when I'm back um but I just like to take my makeup off before I work out so I'm not breaking out even though I am right now I'm just wearing this cute set from 437 I finally got the sweater which is so cute really cute all matching and the brown this is espresso it's really really cute good morning it is currently 5 30 a.m and i'm going to berries it's friday this is my cute set it's new it's the black from 437 the shorts and the micro bra and underneath these are the shorts and i regret walking this because it's kind of cold outside but i'm gonna wear the long sleeve and then a sweater on top my legs make it cold though but... i recorded a podcast episode about having like a morning routine and how to get up earlier and i actually took my own advice of like how to actually like get out of bed when you want to get out of bed if you want those tips go listen to the episode it's called the that girl morning routine okay i got gifted this from symbiotica and like i've been wanting to try it since i heard the founder on um the what we said podcast okay this is the super greens with chlorophyll it's citrus lime i really want to try like the magnesium and the other ones actually it tastes pretty good